Mr. Ramfa Lee. <clears throat> Gentlemen, can I have your marks, please? Gentlemen, or shall I say partners? Mm. Oh, I drank to that. Hi, darling. I'll get the ass on. Hello, Los Venturas. I don't like to talk to you. I told my servant, shut up or go home. Hello? Carl, it's me, Ken. The Leon family has made their move. Salvatore's here. Now, he's taken over Caligula's. We're screwed. It's war for control of Venturas, man. War. War. There's word of some triad visitors, something that should keep them busy. I'm calling from the bathroom. I gotta go. I really gotta go. Mi barrio es todo, homie. Top fucking buzz this! I'm peeking on the blood pressure alone! Yeah, terrific. Well, well, well. What do we got here? Here's your sandwich. Who's this pretty thing? I don't usually do this kind of shit, you know. <laughs> I like this girl. What's your name, kid? Maria. And the service is not included. I ain't the woman, you fat fuck! You heard the bird. Come on. <laughs> Are you kidding me? See you later, guys. And who's this asshole? The name's Carl Johnson, sir. Before working with Mr. Rosenberg here, I had the pleasure of doing business with your son, Joey, back in Liberty City. You know my Joey? I like that. So, kid, what can I do for you? Well, Ken, vouch for me, I'm a straight killer. Oh, but one man fucking army. A, a real dependable. Total fucking maniac, too. You know, the Ferrellis are sending over a crew to hit me. Their flight gets in soon. Traveling is a string quartet. <laughs> I was gonna send some of the boys over as a little welcoming committee. But uh, maybe you can take care of it. Thank you, sir. I guarantee you, you won't regret this. Uh, maybe I should go Whoa! around that, 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 You stay where you are, Rosenberg. I don't want you getting yourself lost.
I got the files. What you want me to do with them? Well, we need to meet up someplace quiet and take care of things. There's a ghost town, Las Brujas in the Devil's Castle. You know it? Yeah, I'll find it. I know you will. i see you there. Carl. Put your girl very clever. This driving thing?
Hope we didn't keep you waiting, Holmes. No, I was just chilling. <laughs> I bet you were. At the dossier? Hand it over. Hey, everything cool now? I don't know, Carl. Eddie? Ah, our boy's done good. No! Oh! You snitch piece of shit! You vato asshole! You sold us out! Time to dig, Carl. You take care of things. Huh? Where are you going? To get drunk and get laid. You got a problem with that? No, Frank, relax. Good. I'll see you back at the precinct. And I'll see you in the next life, Carl. That's good. That's deep enough for two. Eddie, Tampenny's just using you. He's using all of us. You're the next one he's gonna silence, man. Shut the fuck up, scum! And it's Officer Pulaski to you! Fucking die! inside my head. Feeling so fucking full of yourself now, huh? <coughs> yeah, well, them's the breaks, fuck. Any last requests? Yeah. <laughs> Can I fuck your sister? You an asshole to the end. Punk motherfucker. Hello? You've hung us up to dry, I know it. 
Rosenberg? Yeah, soon to be wearing concrete shoes in a shallow grave in the desert, Rosenberg. I'm surprised you remember. Look, I ain't forgot y'all, man. Just hang in there. Easy for you to say this Salvatore guy might whack me at any moment. Just feel the weight of the weapon, sweetheart. <laughs> I can feel the weight of someone's weapon. Hey, you don't want to blame on that front. Can I fucking go now, or fucking what? Ooh, you fucking twat! Right in the fucking happy sack! Perhaps you'll be cured of your little anti-social condition, mate. Carl, it's my man. Mr. Leon? Looks like this piece of shit was right. You did a real number on those Ferelli losers. Now it's time the Ferellis found out what it means to screw with Salvatore Leone. How would you like to hit the St. Mark's Bistro? A hit in Liberty City? Cool. But I'm gonna need some backup. Take who you want. Well, I usually use these two. Hey, hey, remember all those jobs we did together? Huh? Huh? You and me, Carl, remember? Huh? You know, you used to call me Killer Ken. Ken the Killer? Killer? Ice Cold Ken. That's me. And him too, I guess. Alright, you guys better get out of Los Venturas fast. I'll be in touch. What about your backup, man? Will you be alright without us? Of course he will, you fucking moron! Come on! Rusty Brown tastes like dolphin brain. But crap! This station is owned by ammunition. I mean, have you ever heard anyone complain about guns on this station? Hosts are getting shot by them all the time, and it just gets glossed over. But <laughs> also means I, I now have a job. If you're afraid of your mortality and never want to die, here's the solution. It's a man who's got all of America talking with his unique approach to spiritual matters. He's helped thousands, or so the press pack tells me. Chris Formage, founder of the Epsilon program, is here. Hello, Chris. Kiflam, brother, brother. What does that mean, man? So, Epsilonism, is it a load of crap, or is it the future? Well, what do you think, Laszlo? I don't know. Chanting lip balm. It's Kiflam. Well, whatever. Both sound addictive to me. You know, only popular people are addicted to either. Let's go to the phones. Hey, Chris, Epsilon sounds awesome. But if you read the fossil records, hunter-gatherer dudes had it made. I mean, who wouldn't want to drag their women around by their hair? They smoked anything they could find. That's like so freaking cool. Then all the men would like disappear for days at a time, and you'd only hear bees shrieking in the distance. You know, I went to a museum once. That, that guy's got a point. Points are irrelevant, Laszlo. Let me ask you something. Do you want to be happy, Laszlo? What kind of question is that? Yes, obviously. Then why do you mock the happiness of others? Well, I mean, this is Vinewood. We're all supposed to be, like, psychotic and doggy dog and, you know, bang your best friend's wife. I mean, I'm with that last guy. We all have a primitive side there, Chris. I mean, you should have heard the music I used to like in the 80s. It was, it was hysterical. What's hysterical about being descended from a sponge and not knowing it? What's funny about being told that the world is millions of years old when in fact it's only 157 years old fact and its age does not change? There's nothing funny about that. It's just weird. You know, that voice of yours, man. <laughs> Holy shit. I can believe anything you say. My time has come, Laszlo. And so has yours if, if you let it. Um, well, you know, that, that sounds good to me. Hey, wait. Are you gonna try to sign me up for the military? That happened once before. I mean, I'm into killing people, and I can say, I'll cry when I'm done killing! And then there's Listen, hope. my friend. You can mock, but I know the truth about you. I can see past your jokes into that scared little boy beneath. You, you, my friend, like a lot of other people, are being lied to. 
I totally agree with you, finally. Inversion therapy. I owe my mom a huge apology. Ugh. Listen, pick a new set of lies. Mine are better. Let me ask you something. When did you last get laid, Laszlo? <laughs> Thinking of lies. Wait, look, I'm not an egg. I got laid this morning by twins. Well, they each laid an egg, and I formed out of them. <laughs> what are you talking about? It Great, a horny cult leader with a breakfast fixation. I love it. You know, I'm thinking of a cult centered around grits. Oh, wait, sorry, there already is one, and it's called the South. <laughs> For the last time, this is not a cult, Laszlo. It's a fellowship of like-minded adults who tithe money in exchange for salvation and merit badges. Every single thing we do is voluntary, including the swinging and making things up. Why is this whole town obsessed with swinging? Oh, let's go to the phones. Yeah, Laszlo, love the show, man. Hey, I really love to make out with hot chicks in church. Perfect. Join us. We've put a price on salvation, and it's a price worth paying, believe me. Look, if you crave sexual conquest, family betrayal, class warfare, and really feeling like you are a part of something, then just do it. Just do it. It's so easy. Join the Epsilon Group. Uh. Chris, stop trying to recruit people. I mean, you even say you just make this stuff up. Let's go to the phones. Happened to your mother, but I was quite clear. Grandmother, not mother. It's your fault it doesn't work. I nearly went to prison, man. What you told me to do is illegal in most states. Whatever. Look, Chris... Private function, invitation only. Oh, yeah? Well, Mr. Leon would say it's otherwise. Yes!
presents entirely believable sports action. Grown men fighting in leotards with their bare hands and thighs. This is manly, not homoerotic. See as Thunder Beast fights the primordial force of Brontosaurus Rex, the wrestling caveman that drags his woman around the ring by her hair. The wrestling match that the world has been waiting for. And watch the group wrestling match that has some saying we've gone too far. Six men, one ring, no way out but down. Watch the epic battle and wonder at all human culture. Sunday night on Weasel TV. Do you worry that nobody likes you? We'll provide you with friends. This is flight Keep CJ-101 on. out of and Liberty City, requesting Mark. final approach to Los Venturas International. No Over. Flight the CJ-101 seeks out the convenient bits from every three. faith to create a religion that is uniquely American. Hey, Carl, my boy. Mr. Leone. Everybody's talking about the job you did on that St. Mark's Bistro. Thank you, Mr. Leone. And you, uh, you took care of those three loose ends? Yeah, those poor saps ran into a little trouble along the way. You won't be hearing from Mr. Rosenberg again. Good boy, good boy. Now listen, you're gonna have to keep a low profile or people will start to make connections. So let's keep our distance for a while, huh? I'll call you. Thank you, Mr. Leone. Love the hair, brother. Love it. Hey, I was talking to you. Look, no touch. Famous. Don't hate the little man because he's packing the six shooter. Oh, next! Thank you. Thank you! Thank you! Do you know how much balls it takes to stand down here and sing a song like that? It takes guts! I'm, I'm sorry, we're just looking for something with a little more, uh, mass appeal. What could have more mass appeal than a song like Small but Perfectly Formed? Women want me. Men want to be like me. Assholes! Oh. <laughs> Gotta be right. kidding me, right? Damn, this casino game is hard work. I thought it was just a case of opening the doors and letting suckers give you their money. If only. You know what? I'm getting bored here. I'm trying to do business, not audition midgets. People of reduced stature, you mean? Yeah, yeah, I said that. All I know is when are we gonna get some real talent in here? I heard that. Mad dog. CJ. Clean, dude. That's good news, man. Hey, what's cracking? You ready to take it to the stage again? Easy, CJ. Come on, man. One step at a time, you know? I'm almost ready, but... but... But what? I want to go home now, CJ. That's cool, man. I'll take you. Where's home? My mansion, baby. Yeah, I heard about that place. Drugs, sex, all that shit. <laughs> yeah, you know it. Yeah, but... yeah, I've been there. I... I mean... I've seen it on TV. Yeah. Nice crib. Thanks, player. We could do with a place like that to set up in the LS again. Wait for sweet. Mmm. Get things moving. Get out this midget game. But CJ, come on, man. What? I saved your life, man. My mansion ain't big enough. Only got 19 bedrooms, you heard? All right, man. My mansion's been seized. IRS? Nah, not exactly. Who? Nobody. Who, Mad Dog? All right, Big Pop. Big Papa? The drug dealer? Man, you got your multi-million dollar mansion to a motherfucking pusher? You know, CJ, these things happen. I was powerless. You fucking degenerate? Oh, man. How much blow can one guy snort? It's not my fault, CJ. Man, I should have let you jump. Come with me, all of you. We all going home.
Hello? Hey, what's up, Carl? Hey, Kendall, what's up? Nothing, just thought I'd wish you luck. We're gonna drive back to uh, San Fierro first. Wanna check things out there before we hook up with you guys in Los Santos. All right, cool. You be careful. I'll be fine. I got Caesar and Mad Dog to keep me safe. You be careful. Oh, I will. I'll see you in Los Santos. Me and you gonna go in to clear the place out. Good idea. The element of surprise. So the rest of the crew can move in in peace. 